And I couldn't believe it. It's just like our our ears just perked up to the the, the sound of, uh, of Greeny, and it's and it just goes without without saying, man. And this guitar just it's it's one in a million. You uh, now James has some fifty nines, right? Yeah, he has he has some pretty nice guitars as well. He has a really really incredible fifty nine Explorer. Oh wow! Yeah, and those Explorers, are, yeah, those are super super rare. They only made like forty four of them over the over like fifty eight, fifty nine, and sixty. There was a time where uh, I always hear these uh, kind of things that come up the wire to me, like you know, oh Kirk did this or that. But I heard there was a time where you were trying to own most of the Karina V's that were made in 58, 59. You know, I, I, there was a time when I, I was looking to buy, but then I, 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 I discovered that there was this one guy who, who has almost all of them. Really? So, so you can't even like begin to like go out and, and look for them because they're already in a, a collection. Yeah. And this collection is huge. This collection has over a hundred... 100 standards, Les Paul standards, bro. Over a hundred. Wow. How many? Yeah. How many 59s were there? 150 uh, uh, or 40? 800, 800. Oh, 800. 800 over 58, 59, 60. 60. So you know, do so this that. guy has over a hundred. Yeah, yeah. Is he Japanese? Or? No, no. He's a uh, he's a, a, a very well-to-do um, collector on the East Coast. Yeah. 